Hi, Mooney. Hi. Mooney, say hello. Mooney. We got Mooney. We got Mooney. Hi. 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 Hi.
So I do want to explain so it can help groomers, newer groomers, newer bathers, people who are trying to groom their dogs at home. The reason why I dry with the towel in my hand is because the towel catches the majority of the moisture off the dog and it helps the dog dry quicker. So as opposed to not drying with the towel and it mounting onto the tub and taking longer to dry the dog, I hold a towel in my hand or I'll place a towel down on the bottom grate which is how I started him off initially and I'll start drying him that way because it does help him dry quicker because the towel catches the moisture. So when I hold the ear like that, it helps the ear stay closed so a bunch of air is not getting inside the ear and it helps the noise of the dryer stay muffled so it's not harming their eardrums. As you can see while I'm drying, I try to keep the dryer away from the eyes so I try and blow it in a different direction than from the eyes. I'll blow it on the cheeks or on the muzzle but towards the other eye if I'm trying to get in between those little crevices I will separate the dryer a little bit further from his face and then I'll dry it that way so there's not a bunch of air being blown into his eyes. Now the dryer with the nozzle off is just to go through and to ensure he is completely dry and help fluff out that fur for when I go to shave him down.
right here while I'm clipping his body I'm going to go through and just clipper his head so I don't have to go back and do that when I'm done just so I can get all of my clipper work out of the way and then scissor where I need to I try to keep the same blade on as opposed to switching back and forth because that adds more time to the groom so I will clipper his body in a seven do the seven reverse on the top of his head and then I'll go back once I'm done with the seven blade and go do the ten on the rest of his face where it's supposed to be In that moment, I was feeling where the chest bone was, just so I can set the pattern and kind of show you guys. But I did skim past the chest bone by accident, but he wasn't getting a schnauzer pattern anyway, and I think that's why mentally I did not pay attention to that. So right here I had to cut the audio because they started playing something that I could get copywritten for and then a customer came into the lobby so I will re-add the audio when or if I can. So unfortunately guys, I did go through and listen to the whole track and I do have to keep the volume and the audio extremely low because they were listening to Christmas music and if I turn it up any louder, it'll be able to be detected and I can get copywritten for it. So I turned it down low enough where you can't hear the music and my background music covers it, but you're still able to hear the clipper sounds and the scissors and a little bit of chatter in the salon. Let me know down in the comments if you have any questions, I will happily answer them. Like I stated earlier, Mooney gets a pretty generic haircut, so he gets a seven blade on his body, and then he gets a schnauzer cut on his face. So he gets his ears shaved, his cheeks shaved, the top of his head, he gets eyebrows, and then we'll set the beard. But for the most part, he just gets a seven all on his body, a ten blade on his sanitary, and then a thirty on his paw pads, and then I clipped and ground his nails.
Dogs do not like when you go in between their fur and take their hair out. I don't know what it is. Maybe they're sensitive in between their toes. But that's what he looked back for. And I was like, I'm going to do it. Okay, you don't need this toe fur. We're going to take it out. Because why are you upset about it? <laughs> but he's a sweetheart. I love him.
and just so everybody is aware at this moment I am not squeezing his face I'm not holding his face tight I'm just holding it in place so he does not jerk while I'm clippering around his lips because you can cut a dog that way if they move while you're clippering so I have to hold his face I do have my thumb in between his jawbone just holding it in place and the rest of my hand is on top of his snout holding it in place I'm not squeezing him I'm not harming him I'm just keeping him in place so he doesn't get cut or throw himself back and he falls off the table And also just to state, this is for all the groomers out there, for me to tell customers, for all the groomers out there. If you see us quickly grab a dog, it's because they quickly snatched away and they can fall off the table super fast. So us reacting quickly is us responding as quickly as they did because a dog will jerk himself to get out of something that they don't like and if you let them jerk and just fall back they're going to fall off the table so we have to react fast as well so when they jerk we have to move quickly so they don't hurt themselves
Okay, everybody, we're going to be wrapping up Mooney's haircut soon. I just want to take the time out really quickly and thank everybody for staying tuned and watching this video through and watching my ads. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I really appreciate everybody that is sticking with me. I know I haven't been as consistent lately, but as you can see, I am getting these videos out there, getting the content out there for you guys. Make sure you smash that like button. It helps my channel grow. Drop a comment down below. I love chatting with every single last person, and I love to hear what y'all think, y'all comments, your feedback. I love all of it. And here is a quick little cute before video. This is before his haircut, but after his bath and his little sweet personality. Mooney, hey, stinky boy. Look at that tail wag. Hi, stinky boy. Hi. I know, I know. Listen to you. Hi, stinky thing. Yes, this a good boy. This a good boy. That's a good Mooney. Yeah, you're a good boy. All right, so this is Mooney's finish. He looks so cute. I love his little brownish pink nose. He's absolutely adorable. Like I said, drop a comment down below. Smash that like button. Let's get this video pushed out to the algorithm. Train your dogs for grooming. Share this video. I will catch you all in the next one. Love you guys.